Digital Emblem Explained. Over the last 150 years, the Red Cross, Red Crescent, and Red Crystal emblems have become universally recognized symbols of impartial and neutral aid and protection from the victims of war, natural disasters, and other emergencies. During armed conflict, these emblems are used to identify medical and humanitarian entities afforded special protection under International Humanitarian Law, or IHL. But what happens when armed conflict takes place in cyberspace? How can the emblem protect the digital infrastructure of things like hospitals or humanitarian organizations? The digital infrastructure of these entities must be respected and protected in cyberspace, the same way their infrastructures are in the physical world. In response to the growing number of harmful cyber operations against medical facilities and humanitarian organizations, the ICRC is proposing the development of a digital emblem. Like the Red Cross, Red Crescent, and Red Crystal emblems in the physical world, a digital emblem signals that the marked entities must not be attacked. How would a digital emblem work? As part of their legal obligations, military operators must verify that they do not target protected objects. A digital emblem would signal to the operator that the system they are about to attack is actually protected, the same way the emblem does in the physical world. So a digital emblem gives a digital expression to one of the oldest rules of international humanitarian law. It signals protection. It is not a cybersecurity measure, like an antivirus program. It cannot prevent or stop an attack, just like a Red Cross or Red Crescent cannot block a missile. It relies on the protections of international law, those same protections that have guaranteed the important work of medical and humanitarian workers and their assets all over the world. But what exactly does a digital emblem look like? How does it signal protection? With research partners, we are testing a digital emblem based on digital certificates. A digital certificate is a widely used tool that proves that a website is genuine and trustworthy. When you visit a website, for example, www.icrc.org, your browser will automatically check for a certificate and its authenticity. If it discovers that the certificate is invalid, you will get an alert that the website is unsafe. To verify the authenticity of a digital certificate, your browser checks whether it is issued by a trustworthy authority, which in turn is verified by another trusted authority. This system is called Certificate Chain. For the digital emblem, the certificates would be used to mark the digital infrastructure of medical facilities and the Red Cross and Red Crescent organizations. It can mark the entity's networks as well as individual devices. If a digital emblem exists, any cyber operator would receive a digital certificate that provides a clear message, do not target. This is a protected entity authorized by the competent authority of a party to conflict to display the digital emblem. This technical solution would ensure that a digital emblem is visible to any cyber operator, its authenticity can be verified, and cyber operators can probe for a digital emblem without being identifiable as a potential threat actor. As the number of operations in cyberspace continue to rise, our message must be clear. Whether in the physical world or in cyberspace, health workers, health infrastructure, and humanitarian organizations are never a target.